Hello, and welcome back to Hypnosis Today, where we explore how people are using hypnosis to achieve remarkable things. If you've just joined us, we have as our guest today, Tatiana Igia, and she's going to be talking to us about how she use Skype, uses Skype to increase her hypnotherapy practice. Please help me welcome Tatiana Igia. Now, Tatiana, you have a successful practice in Tarzana, California. Yes. But in addition, you see many clients from Brazil in the comfort of your own living room. That's true. Can you tell us about this? Yes, yes. Everything starts after some family and friends start to do therapy with me. And now I have clients who came from these clients calling me doing, doing, doing sessions through Skype. Can you take us through it? First of all, how did you advertise, or how do you advertise for both your um, local and your international clients? Most of my clients, they come from my existing clients. Sure. But they can find me online through my website, Facebook, and Twitter. Mm -hmm. And they contact me. And when I get their information, I call them back. Now, you call them in Brazil? In Brazil. It's that expensive? I have the international plan, unlimited. Okay. Especially because my family is there, so I like to be in contact with them. Sure. So I have the unlimited international plan. Okay, so s y they contact you, they send you a message on Facebook or through your webpage or on Twitter, mm -hmm. and then you call the person, and then what? I call the person. First of all, I have to know if I can help them. If we are talking about a vocational self, uh, a vocational vocational self improvement. Mm -hmm. Okay, I can help them. The next question, next question is, do you have Skype? Do you have Skype? If uh -huh. they do, great. I just need their contact information. We are ready to go. If they don't, most of the time I help them to set up. It's very simple. Uh -huh. Does not take more than five minutes. Oh, I want to talk about how simple it is. Uh -huh. When I was interviewing you, I wanted to go through the process myself. So I got my computer and I Googled Skype and I started to download it and then it asked me the magic question. Would you like to input your credit card? Is that a Visa or a MasterCard? And so I said, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Right and I stopped right there and you finished the story. Well, everything that you see online on the internet, you should pay attention. Uh -huh. The only one that I know that can offer video conference for free is Skype www.skype.com. Okay. This is the only one that I know that offers video conference for free. So I was still with you and I closed that window and I opened up www.skype.com and then it, I downloaded it. Mm -hmm. It took less than five minutes. True. Uh, double clicked on it and then I put in my, I made up a username which is Lisa R. Mackenberg, one word. Mm -hmm. And so that was very easy. And right from there, again, take us through it. As soon as you finish that, uh, the, your client is going to have their contact information. From their contact information, you can call them. In my case, I call them and I offer a complimentary session. Why a complimentary session? Because it's important to see if they're going to like hypnosis, if it's going to fit for them. Mm -hmm. So if they agree to do the therapy, then we start from there. Okay. Well, you have international calling. Why don't you just do uh, telephone sessions like we used to do in uh, the good old days? No. Especially because you're, like I said, you have a free video conference. It uh -huh. is important for you to scan your client body in many cases. When you, you want to see how deep they are or if you have to desensitize them. Mm -hmm. You know that you have to pay attention on their breathing pattern, their facial expressions, to know what is the next procedure. Mm -hmm. So in Skype allows me to do the scan, to know what is my next step, to follow closely with my clients. And also to do a count out and make sure that everything is uh, going very well. Yes. Um, I've always been a little bit afraid because I thought that the video quality <laughs> wouldn't be good and it would be distracting. Can you speak to that? No, I was. This was my main concern, especially when you're going to do, going you have to desensitize your client. You work with phobia, for example. Uh -huh. This is could be scary, but no, I didn't have a problem at all. I just ask my client to sit comfortably, and adjust the camera if they need. I would like. I always ask it for to, to 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 position the the camera where I can see the chest 
or I can see the face, mm -hmm. so I can track on their on their progress. Uh, since you're the hypnotherapist who uses it, did you get any special equipment for your practice to Skype? No, no, no. Most of the time, in your own computer, you have the input camera. Do you? I do. Okay. Yeah. I did do. you buy an another one, a fancier one? I bought a new one, but you don't need. I uh -huh. just bought because I would like better image, but yes. uh, you don't need it. Sure. And I think that I, Tatiana, if I am going to be doing a lot of Skyping, which I am now since you set me up, um, I think I'll get a superior camera so that the image of me will be crystal clear, which might help my clients feel much more in my presence. Mm -hmm. What do you think about that? It, it helps, helps. Yes. But like I said, Lisa, you don't need, you don't need. My clients, they don't have, and I can see very clear. Mm -hmm. Well, I have to ask a question that's on everybody's mind. Mm. How do we collect our professional fees from our international <laughs> clients? Is, was that on everybody's mind? <laughs> yeah, I thought so, go ahead. My clients, they pay through PayPal, mm -hmm. or PayPal or credit card. And in my website, they have on my page the options to pay or through PayPal or credit card. Now, with credit card, is there a fee? There's a little fee. Mm -hmm. But with PayPal, is there a fee? No. And is it easy to set up with it, PayPal? It's easy to set up. Okay, great. So, when give me the percentages. What percentage are you seeing live locally here in your office in Tarzana versus what percentage are you seeing um, with your international clients? International, 40%. Okay, so 60-40. Yes, yes. Wow. 60-40. And are you speaking in English or Portuguese or Portuguese, both? Portuguese, in Portuguese. Sure, because when people are talking about highly emotional things or things they're having a challenge with, everyone wants to speak in his or her native Uncle, language. Own language, yes, yeah, true. Wonderful. What kind of issues are you seeing here, first of all, with your local clients? Well, most of my clients are weight loss. Really? Yes. Uh -huh. For coincidence or not, they, most of them are weight loss. Well, I have phobia, we, fears, uh, a pregnant right now, she's having a really sickness morning and I'm helping her with that. Uh huh. Wonderful. Well, I'm going to ask you to look into your crystal ball mm -hmm. and taking a look with how quickly technology is changing. What do you think the future is between hypnotherapy and technology. Lisa, I can see crystal clear. In my opinion is, is technology is there. Mm -hmm. And it's proven and getting better overnight. Today I'm able to see clients here in Tarzana. I am able to see clients in my home. I am able to see clients in Brazil, anywhere. Mm -hmm. And this is expands the possibility, which is great. And give me flexibility, what I love. Mm -hmm. And on top of that, Lisa, you know, we know that we have so many great professionals out there. But what makes your clients choose you instead of others? I believe it is your plus. What else you have to offer? Mm -hmm. What is the differentiation? So if your clients can reach you and you can reach your clients anytime, anywhere, I think this is a great plus. Well, I agree because I think that it is a changing economy, it's changing times, it's a changing world. And I don't think that people should have to be limited to the seven million people <clears throat> excuse me, the seven million people that can drive in. Why not reach the two billion people who have internet access? It's true, it's true. People are getting mobile. They travel for work, they travel for pleasure, and they don't need to stop their therapy just because they are not in their town. They can see you, they can still do the therapy yes. with you through Skype. Tell me what your vision is for your practice five years in the future. Well, growing, uh -huh. <laughs> growing, and I for sure am going to use the technology in my favor and to make more things possible. You know, how can people, international people, because certainly we have an international audience and anyone who has internet access can watch this show. How can people both locally and internationally contact you? I have my website. What is it? It's www.tatianahypnosis.com. Uh -huh. And all my information is there. They can contact me through email or call me. And that's it. You're also an HMI graduate. I am. When I did am. you graduate? In last August. So can people find you in the HMI directory? They can find me there. Now people are not just going to want to see you 
for a hypnotherapist, certain people might want to learn how to use Skype to enhance their practice. Are you comfortable with them also contacting you to learn More than this happy. skill? More oh, than happy, terrific. please. <laughs> oh, Tatiana, we're, it appears that we're out of time for today. But I want to thank you so much for coming in and teaching us how we can incorporate Skype and modern technology into our practice so we can reach the two billion people on planet Earth who have internet access and how it is growing every day. And I want to thank you in the studio audience and everybody at home for watching the show. My name is Lisa Mackenberg. And I hope you will join us next time when we meet more people and explore how they are using hypnosis today. Please stay tuned. We have a lot more coming up for you on HMI Web TV. That's hypnotherapy television 24-7. family and friends start to do therapy with me and now I have clients who came from this client calling me doing, doing, doing sessions through Skype. Can you take us through it? First of all, how did you advertise or how do you advertise for both your um, local and your international clients? Most of my clients, they come from my existing clients, sure. but they can find me online through my website. And she's going to be talking to us about how she use Skype, uses Skype to increase her hypnotherapy practice. Please help me welcome Tatiana Ijea. <laughs> now, Tatiana, you have a successful practice in Tarzana, California. Yes. But in addition, you see many clients from Brazil in the comfort of your own living room. That's true. Can you tell us about this? Yes, yes. Everything starts after Facebook and Twitter. Mm -hmm. And they contact me. And when I get their information, I call them back. Now you call them in Brazil? In Brazil. It's not expensive? I have the international plan, unlimited. Okay. Especially because my family is there, so I like to be in contact with them. Sure. So I have the unlimited international plan. Okay, so they contact you, they send you a message on Facebook or through your webpage or on Twitter. Mm -hmm. And then you call the person. And then what? I call the person. First of all, I have to know if I can help them. If we are talking about a vocational self, uh, a vocational, vocational self improvement. Mm -hmm. Okay, I can help them. The next question, next question is, do you have Skype? Do you have Skype? If uh -huh. they do, great. I just need their contact information. We are ready to go. If they don't, most of the time I help them to set up. Welcome back to Hypnosis Today, where we explore how people are using hypnosis to achieve remarkable things. If you've just joined us, we have as our guest today Tatiana Igia, 